welcome to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today I'm excited to show you the all new Game Vice Street Fighter Edition. Now, this year is created by a company called Game Vice, which makes these cool looking kits that convert your phone into a game controller. Literally, it goes down to the actual thumb pad itself, even triggers on the side. And not to mention, it feels like a real controller. So I'm really excited to see what this is all about. Now, this here's a Street Fighter Edition, in which you get specific Street Fighter skins for your game vice itself, as well as a game to download for your phone too. Now, this here's for the iPhone, but you can also get it for your phone as well. Just check out their link down below. And with that being said, let's go ahead and open this up and see what it's all about. Alright, so this here is our game vice uh, in which you know it kind of shows you everything right over here So you see like the game being played and then you got the controls on the side on the back here kind of shows you how it works out So it can fold up uh, and kind of stretch and just kind of fits over your phone just like that. So let's go ahead and open this up now All right So right off the back you do see the controller right on the top here So let's go ahead and pull this thing out and check that out <laughs> so very interesting design i have to say um so you got some joysticks here on the top uh you got your y x uh, a and b and then you got your three different buttons such as your menu uh, and then you got an analog control as well uh and then on the top you have your triggers so definitely a good amount of different buttons just so you can play your different games uh, on the side here it looks like a locking mechanism as well uh, depending on the size of your phone and then we have our uh, aux cable jack over here as well as our charger port now uh, the way it kind of works is uh, you just go ahead and plug your phone on one end here and then just kind of lock it in place like that uh, now if you have the smaller one you just go ahead and slide this key right over here there you go and now it's actually designed for a smaller phone so quite interesting design on how they do that and then I uh, just go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and open this up again. There we go. And then you just go ahead and fold over itself. And then I believe it just there you go. It's magnetic. <laughs> Check that out. Uh, so you can just go ahead and transport it just like that. Uh, let's see what else is in here. All right. So we have a brochure or a, uh, a startup guide. Uh, so let's go ahead and open this up. Sweet! Um, so these here are some stickers that you can actually, uh, or skins I would like to say, that you can put on your control pad itself just to give it a nice custom look, uh, especially with the whole Street Fighter theme and all. Uh, so we got Ken and Ryu and then we got like a few different characters like Chun-Li over here. Uh, and then you know, kind of gives you a few different options. So over here is a Game Vice sticker, which is nice. Uh, and then here's our instruction manual. And then yeah, that's about it. Now when you do purchase the Street Fighter Edition, it does come with a gift card where you can actually download the app uh, for Street Fighter onto your phone so you can go ahead and play it. So let's go ahead and hook up our phone to this and see how this works out. Alright, so let's go ahead and set this up. Uh, so I have a iPhone 6 Plus over here, and then just goes ahead and clips in on this end here, just like that. And then from here, you just go ahead and slide it onto the other side. Alright, and then it just goes ahead and locks into place just like that, and we're all set, ready to go. So let's go ahead and open up the app here. Alright, so it's starting up, uh, and this over here shows the battery life of the controller itself. Sweet! So let's click on that. All right, so we're gonna click on solo play here and just click on arcade uh, and then click okay. All right, I'm gonna pick Ryu. Oh. So you got a bunch of different characters as well, which is neat. All right, so let's go ahead and try out these buttons here and see how this plays out. Oh yeah, let's go, let's go. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, take that. There you go. So you can use the joysticks as well. Ah! <laughs> there you go. Let me press this button here too. Check that out. Oh, snap! Come on, bring it on! There you go. Oh no, she's gonna kill me. Take that. Yeah, that's how it's done. <laughs> so, you know, kind of gives you an idea how it works out. It's almost like a really cool arcade system in your own pocket. Uh, definitely better than using the controls from the game. Like, for instance, this is how it is from the game. So you can see that it's a little bit more difficult, but you know if you just start using these, it's easier and it kind of gives it more of an arcade feel to it as well. 
And obviously you can download different games, but uh, this one's obviously, you know, it's designed for the Street Fighter game. Uh, so let's go ahead and quickly just pause it for a second. There you go. And uh, I'm gonna go and grab some skins here and see how this looks out. Uh, so I have Ryu and Ken. I'm gonna use these because uh, these here are my favorite characters. So I'm just gonna peel this off. I'm gonna apply it straight. All right, sweet. Check this out. I have my skin on here, uh, ready to play. Um, actually, gives it a very cool looking appearance. All very customized look, I have to say, the nonetheless. Uh, so let's go ahead and beat this girl up here. <laughs> Come on, take that. There we go. <laughs> and there you have it. You know, check that out. This here is a nice Street Fighter arcade machine. Uh, literally, it converts your phone into an arcade center. So what more do you want? All right, well, there you have it. This thing is a lot of fun. Not to mention, it literally creates your phone into a game controller. And the fact that it feels so solid almost feels like I'm playing a real game console. Now, the quality of the buttons, as well as the response of it, are literally phenomenal. And I have to admit, it's actually one of the best game pads I've used yet. Now, for this particular kit, if you had any questions on, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you again for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.